Hello and welcome to Goa 365's English News Bulletin. I'm Maithili and these are the headlines. State Cabinet approves much talked about beach shack policy. Allocates 90% shacks to experienced operators, 10% to new ones. 79-year-old man grievously injured in hit-and-run case at Vasco's MMC Garden. Hunt for absconding suspect underway. World leaders begin arriving in India as New Delhi prepares to host the final leg of G20 summit. UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak, US President Joe Biden land in the national capital. And now for the news in detail. The state cabinet today approved the Goa Beach Shack Policy 2023 by which 90% of the shacks will be allocated to experienced shack business operators while 10% of shacks will be allotted to new entrepreneurs from Goa. Other key decisions of the cabinet included policy approvals of iron ore dump handling and land transfer from DRDA to the tourism department for a mall. It is an uh, approval of the shack for Goa State Shack Policy 2023. That's uh, cabinet has approved in there, sir. Shack policy approval kala 90-10 ratio is 90% those who are the experience and 10% new jas navin je kon shack hat pe ni kalpa chutta. New burgang opportunity diupa khati Goa ne chila tenka khate. 10% uh, reserved over there. And there is a uh, policy for, the reg uh, for regulating the iron ore dump handling in the state of Goa. Dump policy and shack policy, Doni Azjasa, the cabinet has approval. Transfer of land of the 2000 square meter to the village panchayat Bati, government land village panchayat Ditami. Uh, grant of ex post to approval extension of services to Dr. Sushila Mendes, professor in the history for the government college for on the superannuation. Uh, 10,000 square meter lands to the tourism department to transfer to the Unity Mall Government of India to project so that we have bid for it. So, we have to tourism department to the so that tourism department to the Unity Mall of India to the Unity Mall of India. Approval of the transfer of land from the DRDA to tourism department for Unity Mall. Introduction of the single file system into the director of the public grievances. Proposal for the amendment of the increase in the stipend of the SCSC trainees in the Labor Welfare Center. Providing laying, testing, commissioning of the sewage network and trenchless methods and including the construction of the manholes, etc. in Penjim. Ex post factor approval for the sanctioning take up and work by the PWD department, uh, additional work, Penji and surroundings. Uh, it is awarding for the project management consultancy for the Darasho company. Uh, for the Kunbi Handloom village at Sangem. Grant of approval of the expenditure sanction of the 63 crores towards the wellness pharmacy at the Goa Medical College. Sewage treatment, uh, universal walkway, uh, smart city uh, tender. We have to examine the sewage network almost two years ago. So, we have to do concrete road. We have to do concrete road. Already existing sewer line is deteriorated. So, this is smart city. So, the cabinet approved that PWD is under the PLA culture and the smart city is under the universal walkway. Grant of the approval of the sale of the sale of the Dr. Tristav Braganza Dr. Kunna Sports Complex at the Kasaulim. For the highest bidder, H1 bidder. There are many bandas in the sports complex. There are many shops. 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 The cup uh, lease got the preference is giving for that local also first and if not local is coming then we are giving for the outside that panchayat. Dylan Rodrigues, Subhashish Govekar and Nikhil Jalmi for Goa 365. A 79-year-old man was critically injured after a hit and run driver of a nano struck his scooter near Vasco's MMC garden. The victim has been rushed to hospital for treatment of his injuries and the search for the missing suspect is underway. Vasco just now a hit and run case that the accident was caused by the people who were in the car and the car was 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 in the car. 
दोग जन वैंका खेत हिट एंड रन जो जुआ कॉलसो हो जो एक्सिडेंट जो सेवेंटी नाइन इयर्स एक तकले मार लो बड़ी दुखापत जाली आसान तक हॉस्पिटल शिफ्ट के तसे हि जी हंगा एक्सिडेंट जला हंगा हिट एंड रन केस जाली आसा लोक मगनी है कि लोग जो अ हिट एंड रन करता बड़ी कारवाई कड़क कारवाई जा जेनेकर असेसीस जता खेत थामते हैं ये जे ओवर स्पीडिंग करता है जे हिट एंड रन करता हेचा खीर जे पर रवाय ना हेचा खीर लोक मगनी हा केसी कड़क कड़क कारवाई जा कड़क कारवाई जाए केसीस थाम हाँ क्रॉस जो फ्रेंड हाँ दोगी एक गाड़ी आयो उड़े 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 को मिस्टेक जाऊ कितने गाड़ी रहा जाए बाबा कित जा तो मार्ला नहीं धा मैं लोग एक इंजर्ड जो मार चढ़ मार लगो ना पुण इंजर्ड जो का गाड़ी घूम तो डॉक्टर को लेकिन माशे तकले मार लग बोन आवाज ये आवाज ये बर पाला हंगा एक्सिडेंट जो टू व्हीलर एक फोर व्हीलर आदला आदले उपरान एक फाटल बसले तो पड़ो अमत हेडेक तकले इंजर इंजरी जाता रगत यूं लगे तो अमत पड़ो हाथ तेज टिस्ट आसो हमें तक हाथी सामाप क्या मेडिकल ये क्या जाए जैसे हाथ फ्रेक्चर यूं शकता सीलन रायडर दो जन ये फुड़ा सैडीन एक नैनो कार आई तक मार्ली मार्ली पड़ो तो पड़ो फाटल फुड़ा रायडर फुटल एक मार बस इतना रगत वाला प्रॉब्लम कि एक्सिडेंट जो इतने फास्ट चलता एक तो गाड़ी ब्रेक मार्ले जो गाड़ी मार्क आता तो गाड़ी मारपी मारो पड़न गए लोग उलता कि चलपी डॉक्टर आसो डॉक्टर आसू को एक्सिडेंट के राव नी तक एटेंड करा नी एटेंड कर मारो गो लोकानी माँ देख घ हिट एंड रन पुलिस कड़ी मगनी कड़क कारवाई जा मारला अरेस्ट कर शूड बी अरेस्टेड इंटरनल रोड वो रोड आसा एकदम बिजी रोड हंगा बारीक स्कूल आसा हॉटेल्स आसा सब इतने पास चलता अरे खे वो इतना गड़बड़ी लोक मारन पर मारता धावन वोता हिरु महाले सृष्टि थानेकर एंड ओंकार देश प्रभु फॉर गॉ थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव विल शॉर्ट ब्रेक स्टेबिताज वेलकम बैक Confusion and controversy struck Margao after MLA Digambar Kamat questioned what opposition could the civic body have against a proposed restaurant at the still to come up multi-level parking complex. Ironically, while the opposition has opposed the idea, the municipality chairperson says that he has no idea about the so-called restaurant proposal. Shadow Council convener Savio Kutino charged that such repurposing of projects will take a negative toll on Margao. While Margao already suffers from a lack of parking spaces, a multi-story parking facility is a need of the hour. He stressed. Listen. Municipal de partle an jo multi-level parking complex jo ye baat hai. Kya badal ame Margao ka andar jo ek statement hai kala ki toh restaurant gal pa gaile dalat kiti zada kya mat. Sangpa mandar restaurant gal pa provision hui aashil le. रेस्टोरेंट घपा प्रोविजन ना काउंसिल कसले डिशीजन घेवन कि रेस्टोरेंट घाल रेस्टोरेंट घायल जैसे रेवन्यू ये मनो पुण रेवन्यू ये बर आसा तो मल्टी लेवल पार्किंग कॉम्प्लेक्स बनता क्या कि एंटायर मारगव लोक पार्किंग स्लॉट ना पार्किंग एवेलेबल आसना तो एक डेडिकेटेड पार्किंग ये आसो कॉम्प्लेक्स आसो लोग पार्किंग करता तू जे रेस्टोरेंट घपा सोता जो रेस्टोरेंटा वेहकल हाटो तो फॉर नो रिजन लोग रेस्टोरेंटा रेस्टोरेंटा जे ये पैल सुधा पार्किंग करता लोक पार्किंग कर जेना मुनसिपल बिल्डिंग एक समझू शकता सपोज इवन तू कि दुसरे थी घाल सोता जो मुनसिपल मुनसिपलिटी संगा मैं शॉर्टेज आसा प्लेस एंटायर कॉरिडर चार वटन एंटायर कॉरिडर तुगे रिकॉर्ड्स भरला कबर्ड्स भरला थी एक मुनसिपल एनेक्स बिल्डिंग आसपा जाता है एक एंटायर फ्लोर दिवा जो फॉर मुनसिपल Former MMC chairperson Lyndon Pereira said that no such proposal was placed before him during his tenure. I was the chairperson of Madam Secretary from 2021 to 2022 August. I did then after that during my tenure there was a party level party project. At that time we had another was to cheese soda, but there were no repeaters coming. So cheese soda had taken over. And we have transferred all the money to G Suda. During that time, we had no proposal of a restaurant. So there is no restaurant during my time. But now I think they have modified the restaurant. 
Even Ghansham Shirodkar, a former MMC chairperson, said that no such proposal was put to him regarding the restaurant. Listen. Atta in G Sudan Dune, there was Sudale almost last chairperson Linda Nastana, Ami Councillor Sukri Resolution and Gion, a Bare Pajatin, Bare Ground Plus Four, Five, Bare A Parking, the Margam Vitor Na, the Ashi Pajatin Zauche, Ashi Tavala Toronami. Unanimously, even Mother Viro Dastanabut, I may support Kalog down with Amargao Hatezata. But at the per Amdaran statement, Kalaki, Turkey, the three restaurant, hotel, Kiditri Zata, Kurpaki, the objector, counselor, and Kid plan the Kelat, Kidia Shabimur. So I may opposition the Bassinja Port of Counselor of Sats, together as a Tangasagana with Sale. ऑलमोस्ट <laughs> 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 Amendment 373, 374, amend down. Panchayat Raja Pramani Panchayati Kam Koro Lagle. Municipality 74 Tan Ami Asun Koro Municipality Koslet Power Dorona. Well, and on the contrary, the ordinance is not the same. It is not the same. It is the same. It is not 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 MMC chairperson Damodar Shirodkar also emphasized that he was unaware of the proposal. He, however, said that if it is the MLA who made the statement, then only he would be able to clarify the issue. Sadip Tuaykar, Subhashish Govekar and Omkar Desh Prabhu for Goa 365. Ahead of the G20 summit being hosted under India's presidency, world leaders have started arriving in New Delhi. UK Prime Minister and Joe Biden are some of the prominent leaders who have landed in the national capital. UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak and US President Joe Biden on Friday arrived in Delhi for the summit scheduled to begin on September 9. This is Rishi Sunak's first official visit to India. Prime Minister Narendra Modi is expected to hold 15 bilateral meetings starting with US President Joe Biden over the course of the next three days. It will be the second bilateral meet between the two countries in less than three months. What's on the India-US agenda? Likely discussion on GE jet engine. Discussion on procurement of Predator drones from the US. Collaboration on critical and emerging technologies. Conversation on progress in the civil nuclear area. US may announce major rail deal with India, Arab world. Deal is to connect Gulf countries and other Arab countries. Addressing the pre-summit brief on Friday, G20 Sherpa Amitabh Kant said that the New Delhi Leaders' Declaration is almost ready and that the declaration will have the voice of Global South and the developing nation. We got the perspective of 125 leaders and then we remain focused on the perspective of the Global South and the requirements of the developing countries. And the New Delhi Leaders' Declaration, which many of you will see, post the summit, you will see it as a voice of the global south and the developing countries. No document in the world would have such a strong voice for the global south and the developing countries as the New Delhi Leaders Declaration. And therefore, the Prime Minister's vision 
of India's G20 presidency being a very inclusive presidency uh, has been our aim. The two-day summit is expected to expand on topics ranging from finance to climate change. However, India is likely to focus on India-specific areas such as accelerated, inclusive and resilient growth, women-led development, multilateral institutions for the 21st century and digital infrastructure. Manish Parab and Shivani Sangelkar for Goa 365. We'll take a short break. Stay with us. Welcome back. Now for some sports news. Sports Minister Govind Gaudi on Friday said that even if the state government has lacked in some aspects related to the upcoming national games, the government has disbursed 19 crores to various sports associations for procurement of sports equipment ahead of the national games. With Goa gearing up to host the upcoming national games, Sports Minister Govind Gaude on Friday said that the government has disbursed an amount of 19 crores to various sports associations. Gaude also said that the government is open to hosting the rifle shooting event in either Delhi or in the state while further adding that most of the games will be played in Goa. Being as a sports person, I hope that the government has been working on the government. I hope that the government has been working on the government. Equipment to purchase, करपा करके के बाद diet तो coaching camp तो है। तो कहीं कुछ नहीं, सब थोड़ा party उड़ी लगा सकता। पर procedure जो आता है, कहीं कुछ नहीं, सर्वेट कहीं कुछ नहीं, director of sports and youth officers या किन्हें director अगर कि हम चल lower staff अगर है ना इसमें finance department लगता, finance अच्छे very सस्ता, तो एक very सम का comply कर चुका पड़ता। अंते comply के लिए अंतर जो कहीं कुछ नहीं जा सकते, हम चेक करता। आमी personally monitoring, अदर I think by today morning, then just again, come back to the police transfer. I mean, I think all the other things are not going to be able to do it. I think all the other things are not going to be able to do it. I think all the other things are not going to be able to do it. I think all the other things are not going to be able to do it. प्रोसेस चालू पड़ी करें डॉक्टर तेरा ना हम जानते हैं आज परिणत हमें कोई लोग जेदे वाला चेहरा शिल्प नहीं रहते वाला चेहरा हमें दिल्ली ऐसे मिल नहीं पर आज हम ची यश एकेडमी जैसा पड़ी नहीं तातुन भीतर फुल्लो प्रोस्पेक्ट्स हमें इस बार हमें इन्वेस्टमेंट जर करता इंस्टेड ऑफ गोइंग हमें ट्रेन का यूज़ टीजर आंसर जर दाता तला मुझे पुलिस ट्रेनिंग मनोन का कि वह बाकी जस्ट सब जो हम चे एनएसएस जे यूनिट्स जैसा कि मैं एनसीसी यूनिट्स जैसा तो तो फुली इन यूज अने समके सभी फैसिलिटी अंगल जरिए इधर तो चला चलें। We are open, otherwise we have already booked by मुझे पहले उस बुक के लिए शुल्क है। But definitely maximum में जो स्पोर्ट्स डे जाता पे नहीं। तो गोइंग क्या होगा चम्मच पर। डिलन रोड्रिगेस, मनीष परब एंड निकिल जल्मी for Goa 365। We have finally got some rain in Goa. After almost a month with hardly any rain, the heavy showers are definitely a welcome sight for citizens. IMD says the downpour will continue at least for the next three days. The department has also raised a yellow alert warning citizens of heavy rains that might come with strong winds. Here's more. It's been raining on and off since Thursday and some areas did get some pretty heavy showers. The weather cooled down quite a bit on Friday. Temperatures just barely touched 30 in some centres, while others all registered the highest temperature between 25 and 28. Officials over at the weather department have predicted similar weather for Saturday. They say heavy showers will be more frequent and widespread, so it would be advisable for citizens to carry along a raincoat or an umbrella when stepping out. The maximum and minimum temperatures on Friday are forecast as 31 degrees Celsius and 23 degrees Celsius respectively. IMD predicts heavy rains over Goa until the weekend. Yellow alert warning issued until the 10th. Windy conditions expected to prevail. Maximum and minimum temperatures on Friday, 31 degrees Celsius and 23 degrees Celsius respectively. No weather warnings issued for boat owners. Bureau report, Goa 365 with inputs from IMD. With that, we have come to the end of this news bulletin. For more news and updates, log on to our website www.goa365.tv. Follow us on Facebook and YouTube Goa 365 TV. Take care, stay safe and keep watching Goa 365.